hello friends in this video i will show you black hole attack in aodb routing protocol aodb routing protocol is a reactive routing protocol it means whenever any node wants to send any data to another node at that time that node go for route searching so here uh, we are having node a c b e f and node m this node is representing a malicious node so objective is that node a wants to send data to node e so in a is not having any idea about how to send a data packet to e where there uh, is node e exists in network so a will start route discovery step so in this route discovery a will send a r r e q route request packet so this packet if you can see uh, the first attribute this is the originator address or we can say this is a source address second one this is a source sequence number so these sequence number actually works as a, a kind of timestamp the third one this is the broadcast id this is the id for route request packet fourth one is your uh, destination address uh, so it means whenever this packet is received by any other node those node also would know that node A wants to search a path to node E. Uh, fifth field is empty. Uh, this is a destination sequence number. So initially A is not having any information about E. So this field is left empty. And the last one, this is the hope count. Uh, hope count from the current node to the originator. So initially this packet starting from a so that's why this is a zero so a will broadcast a route request packet so these packet received by m and c and so if these nodes having any uh, route any path for to, to reach node e they will reply otherwise they also uh, broadcast these requests so we are considering only this scenario uh, what will happen here uh, this side C will broadcast it then D, D will broadcast it and finally A receive it so we are skipping this part we are uh, considering this scenario what now malicious node will do so what this node M will do ok this is uh, the backtrack A uh, C I, after receiving this packet C also would know that uh, in order to reach A I have to transmit packet in this direction here node uh, M also not having any information about node E and this node is not connected to node E but, so now this node will create a fake route reply packet and this route reply packet will say that uh, in order to send any data packet to E forward all those packets to node M so M will prepare a fake packet so this packet if you can see uh, this is the uh, information about this node this is the originator of, of the route request packet this is the destination sequence number and this is the hope count so M is sending this fake information that node E is reachable from M with hope count 2 and M will send this packet to A so when A will receive this packet A, uh, A will conclude that node E is reachable via M with hope count 3 and A will store this information so A will create a entry in the routing table that if the destination is E forward those packet to M and this is having 3 hope count and sequence number is 120 so in future in future now e a wants to send some data to node e a will check its routing table and a will find out in order to send data to e next hope is m 
A will send this packet to M. And now what M will do? M can drop these packets or M can forward these packet to other malicious node. So it will create a kind of black hole. Means packets are coming here but it is not forwarding those packets. So this is black hole attack. Thank you very much.